was just six days ago that NASCAR driver Ryan Newman was in this violent crash. And tonight, for the first time, we are hearing from him. Thanks for joining us. I'm Allison Lattice. Somehow, Newman escaped from the crash alive, and now he says he escaped with no broken bones. Channel 9's Deshaun Brown is live at the NASCAR Hall of Fame in Uptown Forest tonight. And Deshaun, Newman also said he plans to get back in the race car. He did, Allison. The team president said he actually spoke to Ryan Newman one more time before reading off his statement. And he said that Ryan wanted to make something very clear. His goals for this season have not changed. He is also very much still trying to win a cup championship this year. Now, all of this, of course, came from that statement today read by team president Steve Newmark. And it said that Newman did not suffer any organ damage or broken bones. He also suffered a head injury last week, which he is being treated for. This, of course, comes after a horrifying crash Monday at the Daytona 500. Newman also took the time today to thank the medical staff that treated him, the racing community, and, of course, his race team. I have to thank the guys back at the Roush Fenway Racing Shop that built me a car not only fast enough to lead the final seconds of the Daytona 500, but strong enough to do its job under great distress, allowing me to survive such an accident. And Newmark said there is not a timeline yet on when Ryan Newman will return to the game, but when he is ready, that number six car will be waiting on him. Allison. Wow, you can tell it's not just a job, it's truly a lifelong passion for him. Thanks, Deshaun. If you would like to read Newman's statement, the entire thing, or see more about his incredible recovery after that crash, just head to our news app and click on this story. The app is free in your phone's app store.